Everybody, thank you for coming along here today to launch this. The elections are about taking sides. Labour is on your side. This government has cut massively every local authority's budget all over the country. This government has taken £4 billion out of the adult social care budget. This government is underfunding our National Health Service. This government is presiding over a housing crisis that affects almost every family in the country, particularly the poorest families in inner city areas. As they refuse to regulate the private rented sector, do not give local authorities the chance to build houses. Indeed, instead of forcing those in high cost areas to sell off property that is desperately needed. They have presided over a budget that has uh, given to the very wealthiest and taken from the very poorest. They tried to take personal independence payments away those with disabilities. They're taking £30 a week away from those on ESA with disabilities. This is a government that is widening the gap between the richest and the poorest. That allows four million children to live in poverty, up by half a million in the past five years. And news that's just come out of research done by city universities and city university and other institutes shows that for the first time since the 1870s, the life expectancy between the richest and the poorest isn't narrowing, it's widening. In other words, if you're poor, you have a shorter life expectancy. If you live in an inner city area, you have a shorter life expectancy. These elections on Thursday are about electing Labour councillors, and in London and other big cities, about electing Labour mayors. Labour mayors who will challenge the government will try and bring us cleaner air and try and develop housing for the needs of all. But above all, it's an election about hope. Labour local authorities that do their best to defend communities. Labour voters that want something different, that want a government that cares for all, not for the few. Want a society where the gap between the richest and the poorest narrows, not widens. Where public services are for the benefit of all, not cut at the expense of the majority. That's why we're so determined to do the very best we can this Thursday in the elections, to elect Labour mayors and Labour councillors to stand up for the people of this country, not stand aside and allow the government to carry on with its policies of tax cuts for the wealthiest, charges and cuts for the very poorest. Thank you very much, everyone, for coming today. <laughs>